Hello, I'm Emmett Ryan. It's Sunday the Bank Holiday and you're watching Drinking Irish. We're a little bit late tonight because I had a lot of work to do with the magazine today and it's gone great. The magazine's going to look fantastic uh, out this day week, obviously. Hope you've all had a good Bank Holiday weekend. We're going to have a pretty short video tonight because, frankly, a bit tired from all the work. But it's a great beer I've got saved for this and I'm going to enjoy it quite a lot, I think. From Ballyclockhaven in Leash, it is their Blackwell Irish Stout. Now, this is like a very easygoing one, uh, which is great. It's 4.4%, so it's a very, very mild stout. But uh, I'm hoping for a lot from this one. And this is a brewery I've been meaning to have on the show for ages, so I'm really delighted to finally have gotten some Ballyville Cabin in and that I'm able to share with you. Now the head's gone a bit wonky, so it's kind of, mop, mop, mightn't be a sort of video as planned. Uh, but uh, yeah, you know, it's like they're a great brewery. It was on a live time with them with the crack beer community there a couple of weeks ago. They're doing some fantastic work, brewing some great beers. And uh, yeah, you know, it's like the farm has been on the go, just seeing on the back of the bottle since 1639, the family's been going on down there, so. Like, you know, they're in, in Valley Cavern itself, obviously, which is part of Strat Valley. Uh, and so, yeah. <coughs> yeah, this is, well, and look, I can't really even criticize my the heads anymore after the monstrosity I did on Friday night. Like, so, you know, um, going to let this bad boy settle a bit. Uh, yeah, it's it's uh, definitely one. And I've got a six different languages here uh, describing what the ingredients are which as I can assure you are as uh, simple as it gets but uh, can always smell a bit of the bit of the coffee off it just there even with all the heads still on it so this is going to be a nice and splendid little one it's a good type of beer of this strength a stout that's only 4.4 as like you know before it's bed on Sunday evening if you're having a, if you've worked a little late in the night and you need to just have something to ease things off I like this like you know it's the right type of body and it's the right type of strength, like you're not going to be doing anything dangerous to yourself, you know? So it's it's that right blend, I think, that we're going to get going. And yeah, I'm just literally going to keep pouring until the head dies off. <sighs> you know, what else am I going to do? So yeah, Sunday's been fascinating. Uh, lots of work, I said, in the magazine. It looks fantastic so far. Got to really credit the team who always put in extraordinary work and connected in the business post. Uh, the two big production days are tomorrow and, so and Tuesday. Yes, working through the bank holiday because we do it for you, the people. Gonna tidy off this head. The inhalation approach, as I like to call it. And uh, yeah, we'll just give that another second here. I'll put the bottle away. Actually, we'll show you the bottle one more time. And yeah, it's uh, it's been quite a week. It's been busy, you know. But this is the way things go. Been gay catching up with some friends recently. Like I know we all get the zoom fatigue from being too zoomed out, but at the same time. If you're not doing too much of it, I find it's great just as ways to check in with buddies. So that's settled enough. Let's give it a proper sniff. Yeah, I so said there's a good bit of coffee off that. And uh, let's give it a taste. It's a very rich chocolatey smoothness uh, that comes off it as well. Almost immediately. Like I didn't have to think to even get that. Went down quite quickly though. So I'm going to have a sip there and just taste it a bit more. Yeah, and you give it that little chance to linger, the coffee really comes to the fore a bit more. That very smooth chocolatey though feel around the side of your mouth makes it much more gentle. That said, if you tell me blind this is 4.4%, I go, really? It's that mild? So it's a bit of, there's a real power and a strength. Yeah, so I'm liking this one a lot. It's a great one. I'm delighted to finally have Bicycle Cavan on the show as well. Uh, like I said, we're keeping this one as short as I can tonight, but one more sip and then we'll tell you to have a good evening and enjoy your Bank Holiday Monday. Yeah, this is this is a nice beer. It's exactly what you need this sort of uh, time of the week. Slauncha live galere.